Welcome back to some more Walking Dead Destinies. Last time we left off, we found the prison. We got to play as Michonne for a little bit, spent some time in Woodbury with her. She made the governor angry. He, she escaped. He's after her. And now she's at the prison. Well, she just arrived. She's at the gate. So, yeah, that's where we left off. Let's get right back into it. Get away from the mansion area. What? Philip Blake. Okay, what's... We need to get out of here. Why? Um, is because Mel... Mel found out what was going on. And now he's like, you're, you're fucked up. What are you doing? I know and you're... He attacked the Turn governor. Upside down looking for me. So now the governor is on the run from his own his own town. Uh, oh, this is the first time we're using the sledgehammer hammer, hammer as well. Oh, are you on my side? Oh, <laughs> I was like, she's she's cheering for me. She's on my side, but no. <laughs> All right, how do we get out of how do we get out of this hole? It's actually it looks like quite a nice place. Just being a hater. Ooh, thank you. All right, I think I know where we are. I know where I we think are. I saw something. And, ooh, shit! I really should utilize my role. You know, I just oh, I'm coming. I'm very put off by using it because it uses so much stamina. Riders but I probably should. Everyone else is. They're up on the roof. They're up on the roof. Intruder. Is this how we get out? I can't remember. Hmm. Hmm. Just killing all my, killing all my people. Ooh. Time to pick them off one by one. All right. Sniper. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. I know you're there. Shh. Fucking hell! I'm out of here. <laughs> Can I jump? Oh my god! I can't get through these trash bags. Oh. All right. Come at me. Let's go. Oh, adrenaline is pumping. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yep. Roll away. Roll away. Roll away. Where can we go? We're out. We're out. Okay. Yeah. Pretty. They were pretty quick, weren't they? Oh, so we can't get past those those trash bag barricades. Okay. Um. Can I jump over this? No, of course More not. Of course not. Fuck. Wrong button. Need Fuck. Healing. Need healing. Ooh, I'm on it. I'm on it, fella. Alright, here we go. Uh, There's a first aid. Grab that. Need to go around. Use that. Why not? Go around. Oof. That's what I'm trying to do. I guess I have to walk the walk. Walk the walk. Uh, this helps. You know what? You know what? They're just going to keep respawning. Like... So how do I get out? Make your way to the main street. This is the main street, isn't it? Just have to reach that better gate. Oh, thank you. Thank you for showing me game. I'm I'm an idiot. I need I need So who let the zombies out? Oh shit, there's a big boy. Fuck. Woo! Thanks <laughs> guys. Woo! Okay. Now you hold it right there, Governor. Oh, does that have a shadow? It's on? over. Are we gonna have us some fun now? Please. All right. I hope this doesn't mean Merle is our main antagonist now. Organized. They're heavily armed and they've got your guy. What do you mean? That's what you're play recording. I ain't scared of them. Just need to get us some more guns is all. I can help. Then let's get to it. <sighs> West Georgia Correctional Facility. Look at this. Michonne. Michonne sits contemplating her experience at Woodbury when Carl approaches. 
The governor's daughter, he says. Why did you let that thing live? Michonne regards Carl thoughtfully. If you'd seen the look on that man's face, you'd know why. Doesn't make sense, Carl said. He's sick and she was dangerous. You need to do better. Fuck off, Carl! The fuck? Defend Michonne! Mind your business, boy! Give me a break. <laughs> Give me a break. Fucking hell, this kid. Mouth on this kid. Fucking hell. We're making a laugh here. All of us. Making a together. laugh here. All of us. Together. I won't let those things get me. Good luck, Carl. We need to start building a future for all of us. For Judith. For my kids. If I'm lucky enough to have any. Oh my god, I... Oh, that baby. Ugh. Oh. Sometimes I'm overprotective. So annoying. Why is that a bad thing? It is a bad thing. To be Sometimes I wish I was back in college playing football. Maybe I wasn't the best player on the team, but they don't call you T-Dog if you don't have some kind of bite. <laughs> hey, Michonne. The name is Michonne. Are you telling me we are only now? If trust were ever easy. It isn't anymore. It's hard to even trust the people you love. Not that they're out to betray you. Sometimes they're just stupid. Stupid. Okay. These people saved me. Yeah. See what else needs doing. What we can delegate. As the group prepares for the upcoming confrontation, Dal reminds them that they'll likely end up with casualties, so he leads a supply run to find extra medical supplies to treat the wounded. In preparation for the battle with Woodbury, Glenn goes into town to scavenge extra supplies. The stores are all looted, but he's determined to not come home empty-handed. After numerous unsuccessful supply runs in the towns nearby, Carl wants to search the woods for abandoned camps. No, Carl. Um... Extra medical supplies... Um, I'm gonna go with Dale. I mean, the game said it itself. They're all looted. So, we'll, we'll look. We'll give Dale a shot. In preparation for the attack on Woodbury to rescue Daryl, Michonne claims to know where you can find more firepower. Lead a mission there to collect weapons. That's right, Daryl was Daryl was captured. I forgot about that. All right, let's go. The survivors begin preparations to rescue Daryl from Woodbury. They need more firepower to face this new threat. Michonne suggests they check an abandoned store she had found the previous winter. A few hours later, abandoned store near the prison. When the dead come knocking. This is the store Michelle mentioned. <laughs> Are we alone or what the? Okay. Um, let's check our points. Enable sledgehammer technical att tactical attack. Okay. That's gonna be great. Uh, enable sledgehammer devastating attack. Increase the sledgehammer's damage this in, in handy in thirty percent. Uh, machete is better than crowbar, I think. I'm not alone here. Anything in here? No. Need to get ammo and weapons here. Where did that I person go? Huh? There it is. Blood's boiling. Blood's boiling. Mm. Mm. Oh my god, really? <laughs> Adrenaline is pumping. Alright, so I need. Okay. Yeah. So probably better to shoot those helmet boys. What the fuck? Oh, I don't know. 
Oh, we're fantastic. Thanks. Need your opinion. Dale, I found some folks camped out near an old Beamer trailer. I might be able to sneak in and steal some supplies. Leave them none the wiser. Shit, Dale. Uh, oh, steal Let's the supplies. <laughs> we can't afford to add to our Let's troubles see. right now. If you can get in and out without attracting attention, do it. I mean, maybe I should have asked them because we could do with more people to help us fight Woodbury. But then at the same time, it could so easily go the other way. You know what I mean? It's just hard. Like, it's just hard to know what to do, you know? Especially if you're not there yourself. Ooh, is that a, sh that's a sniper rifle? Yes, please. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, no. All right. There we go. No? Hello, trigger. Why are you not working? There we go. Oh my god, there's more. Gun, please. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, let's get out. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Yeah, cheering. Imagine only sending one person, you know, for this mission. Alright, we're out of ammo. Let's just go on along our merry way. Do, 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 do. Get out of here! Alright, look, the zombies can distract them. Well, I'll I just do my thing, you know? I need to take you. Don't mind if I do. I'll take that. Military no grenades. Watch this only kill one person. Um Yeah, what did I tell you? Just one person. Don't mind if I do. Finally. Now we're no, get we out of there. Alright. Let's go. What's this? Shotgun. I've got an assault rifle. Whoa, more guys. Alright, just excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, more ammo is always welcome. Oh. Just a little just a little mosquito bite. Yes! I snuck into the trailer and got a pack full of first aid supplies. I also overheard them planning to go raid another campsite tonight so I wouldn't lose too much sleep over stealing for them. Yes. Good. We made the right decision. Okay. See, you can never tell, you know. You can't. Oops. Oops. I need medicine, please. Thank you. Come on. Hey, shit. Look at them all. Excuse me. How do I get out of here? <laughs> I'm out of here. How do I get out? <laughs> That's where I came from. Didn't I just spawn in? Um. Yeah, this is where I come from. How am I supposed to get out of here? Away from me! How am I supposed to? Oh, right. Which really? Ah. Oh, shit. All right, all right. Let's let's. Let me go. All right. All right. This big guy has a helmet on. Mm. God, where's a grenade when you need one? Two big boys. Fucking hell. Shit, this isn't working. This isn't working. Um, any grenades anywhere? Alright, uh, we should have time now to do this, maybe? Push, yep. Uh, Alright, let's go back around. <laughs> Do 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 do
Come on, go. Uh, right, cool, we're done, we're done, we're done. Nah. Alright, uh, heal ourselves. Let's heal. I need to take the edge off. Yeah, let's go. Woo! That was boring. <laughs> Hold on, Daryl. We're coming for you. <laughs> Oh, I can't stand those baby noises. How annoying. My dreams always seem so boring nowadays. I'm usually just at home watching TV or something. I I guess I just miss doing nothing sometimes. Not much going on up there, Carl. <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> I protect my home. Right now, that means this prison. The end of the world proved the kind of man that I can be. As weird as it is to say, I'm grateful for it. I wouldn't have it any other way. Mm -hmm. Okay. When you get to my age, you end up seeing a lot of death. You'd think it would make you numb, but it's the opposite. Yeah. Thanks, Dale! Thanks. Something to look forward to. Easy these days. I think you should know about this. Stop Shown me. getting into fights with everyone. <clears throat> A group led by Carol gets ready to go on patrol. Michonne volunteers to join. I think you should sit this one out, Carol says, shaking her head. Care to tell me why? Michonne asks. Carol stands her ground. No offense, but we just don't know you well enough yet. We need to be able to trust everyone to watch each other's back. You took me in. Of course I've got your back. Michonne swallows her anger. That may be true. Carol so she concedes. That may be true. Carol is that may be <laughs> I didn't know how do you do a conceding voice? That may be true, Carol concedes, but the stakes are too high. We can't risk it. Not this time. You need me, Michonne states. But if you're too stupid to see that, it's on you. Ask Michonne to stay behind. Give Michonne a chance. Give Michonne a chance. Carol, relax. Give me a break. Give me a break. <laughs> All right. Carol? I used to hide my bruises. The ones that gave me but now i wear my scars proudly because i'm not a victim anymore i'm a fighter all right um table daryl dixon fists uh oh, shane walsh assault rifle okay Rescue Daryl from within the fortified walls of woodbury oh so he's in woodbury how do we know that Okay, I feel okay. Oh, so the people that were attacking Michonne are Woodbury people. Duh. <laughs> I just thought they were random people, you know. Oh my my! Look at what we found on the side of the road. The Meanwhile, in the air arena. to cause us some trouble. My own little brother. Always was a troublemaker. Oh I say he needs to be taught a lesson. And who better to do it than our dear old former governor? Codger. You two are shit. fighting to the death. Last man standing. Or no man left standing. <laughs> That'd work for me too. Show me what you've got. Oh, great. Gotta get me of those walkers. Stay clear of those son of bitches. Yeah, some bitches. <laughs> You're just making things harder on yourself. Help Watch me, walkers. walkers. Help me. There you go. How you like that? You like that? There you go. Just heavy attack him into a walker. Be going easy on you. Now I won't hold back. Alright, okay. Alright, fella. 
Let's go. Is that all you got? Use those walkers, wear them down. Yeah. Kick. I did too kick. Easy on me. There you go. <laughs> Kill him. Really? We'll turn up just in time, I reckon. I'm gonna be pissed if the governor dies right here. Now, you're gonna oh, die. Oh, really? More? Oh, well, what? He has a gun now. What the fuck? No. That's more like. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I just killed a walker. Do you clear those sons of bitches? My teammate. Come on. You like that? <laughs> You had enough, fella? Oh my god, no, yeah, he hasn't! This. Oh my god. Come on. I'm trying to... What's happening? Win the jewel. What do you mean? Okay. I'm trying to attack him! People, not the walkers. Us with our six people group coming in to take on a whole town. But the music goes hard, doesn't it? <laughs> Meanwhile, in Woodbury, in a brazen display of authority, Woodbury's leader forces Daryl to face off against a dangerous foe in the town's twisted walker and arena. Clock is ticking for the survivors to struck. Shouldn't we have gotten this before? That scene? This guy's pissing me off. I don't know, maybe I'm not in a... I don't know, maybe I'm a little testy today. But yeah, I'm not getting Jack a little bit annoyed. Ooh, a hell, assault rifle. I'm gonna bring out the big guns. More ammo's always, more ammo's. <laughs> Are you okay, Shane? More ammo's always welcome. Yes, oh, Axe. Let's do this. Let's do this. Um, Axe is superior to Sledgehammer. In my opinion. Oh my god, let's go. Oh. Um. Better make sure these things can't reach the prison. <coughs> More ammo. More ammo is always you. lock and load. Thank you. Where's that gate we always have to go through? Destroy all the military vehicles. What? Okay, uh, is that a military vehicle? Is that a military vehicle? It's moving, so I'm guessing it is. All right. Banging the serpent. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, 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 where are you aiming, Shane? Two birds, one stone. Get out of my way. Reload. Oh my god, look at this pea shooter. Oh my god. What are you cheering? They're cheering for me. Reload. Alright, 
20 more cars to go. I'll take that, thanks. Whoa! So all the youths, I'm guessing. Out of ammo. Oh, grenade, thank you. We got company. <laughs> I was hoping to blow up the car as well. Oh my god, is this even a military vehicle? No, it's not. Oh my god. Um. Oh, unlimited ammo. More ammo is always you. welcome. Shit. So the moving cars. Lock and load. So look for the moving cars, I guess. Or I can just use my superpowers that I always forget about. Need to reload. Yeah, we'll reload them. That destroyed. Okay. Did I destroy that or? Okay. Lock and load. Oh, it's got a grenade. I'll take that. Thanks. There. Another military vehicle. What? Vehicle. Come on, I'm nearly dead. Fucking hell. It's some health shame. Lock and load. Yeah. Finders keepers, more ammo's always well. Get some help. Thank you. Get some help. Thank you. Like, I don't see, there's probably no point in killing people because they're just going to keep respawning. So, I mean, that's my, Adrenaline is that's my um, assumption anyway, you know. I'm out of ammo. Based on what's been happening so far, Jackpot. you know. Oh my god, points that I don't need, thank you. Excuse me, guys. More ammo's always well. Oh. I'll take that. Thanks. This help. I'll take that. Thanks. Oh. Escape through one of the barricades. I need to take the edge off. Right. I'll take, take that. Off. Thanks. Alright. So do I have to shoot it? I'm out of ammo. Oh. <laughs> With Woodbury destroyed and its leader on the run, its citizens were welcome to join the prison community. Some time has passed and the routines of life now include clearing walkers who regularly pile up against the prison's outer fence. Unbeknown, unbeknownst to the survivors, a new threat is emerging in the form of a deadly flu. Okay, I've turned off tro automatic trophy recordings. Annoying. A few days later. Episode 20 Infected. My blood's boiling. Of course it is. Kill the walkers at the fence. Walk us on the fence. Better clear them. <laughs> they keep piling up. That fence will come down. They're literally not piling up. They're just like, they're not even doing anything. Come on. 
I'm pressing square. I'm pressing square. Right. Fuck My blood's me. boiling. Nice and easy. What are, what drinks are those? Are they, were they energy drinks? I thought I saw Turbo. Oh my god, someone's slipping. Oh no, they're dying from the sickness. Wow. Let's... Shit, something's going on. Shit. Your eyes are bleeding. <laughs> what the hell was that? It's a walker, Daryl. Need to check Darryl. the other blocks. Go, I got them. Okay, be careful. Not, not ready. All right, anything here? Yeah, let's get some Lord, ammo. I can't do that. No, you help! can. You just did. Well, I'm not ready. Need help over here. I'm coming. Get out of there. No! Oh shit, I took too long. I don't want ammo for my crossbow. I don't like the crossbow. I'm gonna wait to they get a gun. Alright, let's go. Need help over here! Come on, hang tight. I'm coming! Alright, um, They oh, got shit. me! Help! My blood's boiling! Can I get a gun, please? Get off them! Got it. All right, let's throw a grenade. Watch out, apes! There we go. Go! Oh, a lot of people. Adrenaline pumping. Um, excuse me. Oh, I can't get past this gore. Okay. Is there a gun up here, maybe? Come over here, everyone. Oh. Uh, let's move this. There you go. Why did you trap yourself uh, for protection, I guess? Shotgun. They got Thank me. You. Help! Get out of here! Get out of here. Get out of there! No! What do you mean? What happened there? Alright. Hey, Ty. Let's I'm get coming. the shotgun. Excuse me, push it! Help! Get the shotgun. Can't, can't do that. Can't, can't, can't do that. You just did. Get off it. them! Pump it! Alright, come back here, guys. On my way! Get some bullets. <laughs> Away from me! You guys good? What the use? Right here the skull. They got me! Help! Oh my god. Away from me! On my way! Uh. Shut up. Get away from me! Below. Get off of me! It's a grenade, right? Oh my god. Move out of the way, idiots! I'll take that, thanks. Let yeah. me go! Need right. help over here! They got me! Help! <laughs> Do I fight? No. Get off them! <laughs> Hey, They're immune. Alright, so we're good here. So, what about you? My blood's boiling. Oops. Nice and good. Oh my god, Daryl. Get out of here! 
shit, we need help. Alright, let's go up here, see if there's any help up here. Come on guys, let's go. Ooh, More ammo is always welcome. Here. What about up here? What's up here? Got it. Alright, somehow. Oh, that's a grin. No, that's oh shit, that's a grenade. Kill them all. How do I cancel? I need help. Sniper. Gotta check us out all this no, keepers. thank you. Um, I'll take that. Thanks. Thank you. Where did the grenade go? I'll take that. Thank you. Okay. Let's... It's our people. They're dying. Finders keepers. Where are all the other people that I'm supposed to be protecting? They just stay in the other. Oh, God. They're just coming from the ceiling now. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> this is all open at the same time. Because walkers know how to open doors. See, Daryl, see welcome. how much better a gun is to a crossbow. All right, there's one more walker. Where is he? Or she? Oh, there you are. Pump it. How the hell did this happen? Some kind of disease. Yeah, Shit, this thing maybe. might just be starting. Boiling. This time, stay dead. This baby packs a punch. It's a shotgun, Daryl. <laughs> Let's kill you first. I was gonna say, what's the bet? It's not doing any damage. But it was. Good game, good game. Get off of me! Get away from me! Oh my god. Adrenaline's pumping! Oh, get your gun out, Daryl. Get out of here! Get out of here! Alright. Nice and easy. It's spreading. Daryl's got it. The hell is it? Some sort of flu. Must have picked it up from those walkers outside of the fence. Same bloody eyes. There's no stopping it. You get it, you have to go through it. We need antibiotics. Well, ain't that just perfect? That fight with Woodbury wiped out our weapons supply. And now this. We gotta do something. Yeah, we're weak, unarmed. We're sitting ducks here. Need to walk and chew gum. Maggie, darling, you think you can <laughs> check the nearby pharmacies for antibiotics? I'll go find us some weapons. You got any ideas where to look? Well, I was just thinking, there's no place like home. West Virginia Correctional Facility. Um, okay. But doing nothing is just kid stuff. I need to grow up, be strong, protect my family, my sister. That's all that matters now. I can't believe we ever thought walkers could be cured. Yeah, that's really dumb. I can take watch <laughs> if you need. This business with the dead coming back, killing the living, turning them. It's horrific. How do we keep our humanity through all this? Mm, yeah. Get our people no, out there exploring. I'm talking. We always need stuff. I'm talking to people. My son, Andre. <laughs> he was my world. My peanut. And I trusted his father, Mike, to keep him safe. 
I was wrong. I can't remember the... I played the Telltale Michonne game, but I can't remember the details. Was she estranged from her husband or what? Um, I can't remember what happened. I don't know if she's being unfair with that statement. I ain't I going down remember. the walkers. No way. I keep wondering what will happen to all of us. Is there anyone up here? I doubt it. Oh, who's this? Just a uh, random? Oh, what? Philip. I'm Philip, not the governor. Not anymore. Okay. My father was a cruel man. I guess the apple doesn't fall too far from the tree now, does it? All right. Send some folks on a supply run. In order to prove himself to the survivors in the prison, the governor goes on a hunt for supplies. Mm -hmm. Carol knows it's going to take more than medicine to save those ailing in the prison. She'll need food to stay. They'll need food to stay strong and fight the infection. And the prison pantries are running low. She volunteers to go search a nearby residential neighborhood for anything that will keep both the sick and the healthy going. Okay, Carol. After numerous unsuccessful supply runs, no, Carol, fuck off. We'll, we'll look, we'll give the governor a go. Return to Rick and Shane's hometown near Atlanta in search for more weapons to keep the prison safe from outsiders. How far away is this place? That place? Threatened by the new virus the fearing and fearing attack from outsiders, the survivors desperately need medicine and weapon, weaponry. To take care of the security issue, they send a man back to Rick, you mean Shane, back to Rick and Shane's hometown, hoping to collect more weapons from the police station. There he runs into a familiar face. After the fall. Episode 1, Days Gone By. What do you mean, episode one? I thought this might be a flashback, but Shane is still in his same... Oh, what happened here? Okay. I'll explore the area to find supplies. So, destroy more boxes, I'm assuming? From me! Alright, we need to shoot this guy so he can blow them all up. Can't, can't do that. <sighs> Right, round them all up. Round them all up. Round them all up. Alright, where is he? Mm, okay. <laughs> oh, Get off okay. of me! Adrenaline is pumping! Keep out of here! I'm warning you! How is Morgan a familiar face? Does Shane know Morgan? What the? Get out of here. Lock and load. Rick roll my way out of here. It's on the rooftops. Yeah. I need to take the edge off. I got it. Um. Uh. Told me about some guy who saved me. Morgan, maybe? All this noise is bringing walkers. Yeah, yeah. Let me go! Uh. Uh. So, how am I supposed to get... More ammo is always welcome. All right. Let me go! Whoa. Pick up sniper rifle. Can I kill Morgan? Go! I never understood why Morgan is such a popular go. character. I found him quite dull, especially with his whole Papasus arc, you know? It was so annoying. All right, uh... Can I kill Morgan? Probably not. Get out of here! If 
find a way to the sniper. Okay. I, look, I tried, guys. I tried. I tried to kill him. I can see you. Keep out, I said. Keep out, I said. Um, I need help there. I need some help. I don't do well under pressure. You know, like, I'm getting attacked. And I need to dodge all these enemies. It's just very stressful right now. Um, and I'm gonna die. I need some help. How do I get through? All right, I need to. Let me cross. I need to get in there, maybe. Oh my God, I'm nearly dead again. I'll take that. How do I get there? I need to take the edge off. Um. Oh, here we go. He's on the rooftop. I need to get over there and slap some sense into him. Yeah. You tried to kill me. Damn it. More walkers. What is this for? Oh, right. I can use this as maybe like protection. Oh, hey, let's man, get that. You better let's put get that, that, that down before I put you down. Yeah, bitch. Oh my god, get out. <laughs> you don't want me as an enemy, friend. Lock yeah. and load. Who go? Clear. Get out of here. Great crowd. Liar. Get off of me. Hands up. Stop right where you do. Oh my god. Go! This helps. How do I get in there? Me? Go! Oh, come on. Get out I was gonna say, did I just kill myself? Um. I need help now. Yeah. I don't know. I'm, I'm so confused. I'm so fucking confused. Oh my god, leave me alone. Go! Ah, you pricks! <laughs> leave me alone, Morgan. So where do I go? Oh. <laughs> Whoa. That's better. Alright. <laughs> Hands. Now drop what you got and go. Your gun, your shoes, all of it. Ten seconds. You Morgan? Yeah, you're Morgan. Rick told me about you. Rick? I know Rick, damn it. He gave me the gun. And I was supposed to... I was supposed to... My Jenny... But I was weak. Where is he? I need to tell him I was weak. <laughs> Sorry, I Morgan. I was weak. <laughs> he didn't make it. Now I'm gonna need to take those guns off your hands. See, we found this prison and... And if you got something good, that just means there's someone who wants to take it. And that is what is happening, right? Why did why did he have to well, say that? We're gonna win, friend. Just need what you got. Why would he say that? <laughs> you gonna be torn apart by teeth or bullets? Go on and take the guns. Meet me around back of the building. I have to clear. I don't understand what's happening right now. <laughs> He's holding us. Gun point, and we're like, we're gonna take your guns, and he's like, all right, I'll meet you at the back, and I'll give you all my. <laughs> what? You know, 
I feel like, okay, we're doing better than we went than Rick did. We've got Philip on our side now. We've probably got Morgan around here somewhere. I think we're doing pretty fucking well. Dale? Dale didn't die. Herschel died, but fuck, I was gonna say, what good does Herschel do? I really liked Herschel in the show. Um, he was a doctor. That's a really big that's a very big L on our part. Anyway, what's the use in dreaming about what might have been? Walker still would have taken over the world. And I'd still be right here where I'm supposed to be. So I guess that was that's really been the only downside of having Shane. We lost Herschel. Other than that, I think we're better off. We were staying at a camp. I was out looking for supplies. Came back. Place was overrun. Mike and our friend Terry, they were high. Andre. <laughs> I was. We're fucking idiots. Gone. For a long time after that. But this group, you brought me back. God, like, ugh, that's so stupid. Hey, Daryl. Daryl. Daryl! She always talked about being able to make the hard choices. I get that now. I see I'm, what has to be done, and I'm not afraid to do it. I'm Shane. <laughs> okay. Uh, I can't talk to Daryl. Okay. What do you have to Day say, or night. Carl? It doesn't matter. It's never safe. Does it matter? Watching nature take back the world? It's inspiring. Okay, Maggie. I don't know. Today I'm almost feeling optimistic. <laughs> my wife was my life. My wife was and my life. And when she died, I thought my life was over too. But you people, you've given me new purpose. Ironic that it took the walking dead to bring me back to the world of the living. Mm. See what else needs doing. What we can delegate. And we have T-Dog. T-Dog wants to... So, so Dale and T-Dog for her, sure. Mm, still an L. Still an L. He's a doctor, you know. T-Dog wants to clear out more cell blocks in the prison. He doesn't like the idea of walkers still inside the fences while even locked away. And he hopes to find untouched stashes of supplies in the other lo blocks. That's a good idea, but I don't really want to do that. Thinning the herd. Walkers are herding... Oh no, um, he'll do that on his own, hopefully. Walkers are herding up in a town not far from a prison, Sha from the prison. Shane leads a mission to thin them out before they reach a critical mass that could threaten the survivors. In order to prove himself to the survivors in the prison, the governor goes on a hunt for supplies. Didn't we already do that? Hmm, I don't know. They're, they're all good. They're all good. Uh, especially these two. We'll go to dog. I mean, they're in. If they're in the prison, we should clear them out. You know. A dangerous new flu is spreading through the prison community. Lead a team to a department store in search of pet medicine that may be the key to curing it. Glenn, Michonne, Maggie. The virus is spreading through the prison at an alarming rate. Those who contract it are being quarantined in an attempt to contain the outbreak, but the death toll continues to mount. The survivors need antibiotics and the solution could lie in veterinary medication. A group is dispatched to a nearby department store to scour the pet section. The next day, Peach Tree City. This sorrowful life. Glenn. We have to find that medicine. I mean, some serious damage with this. Sledgehammer Man. over. Walkers are everywhere. Oh. Nah. Nah. Get away from me. God, the sledgehammer is one shot kill. And this is, this is a light attack as well. 
Oh, okay. Alright. I see you, Sledgehammer. Daryl and the others are counting on me. Find anything? Not yeah. Nothing. Keep looking. Loaded. Boy! But the sledgehammer is definitely the way to go. I just always avoid hammers because they're usually like really slow and nah. heavy, which you know it, it is probably still, but yeah, it's really strong. Got it. Like one shot, one kill. Yes, please. Found it. Oh, okay. Hey, we got an intruder. <laughs> We got him, boss. Boss. Better go check on Glenn. Can we get the sledgehammer and leave your katana, Michonne? I know it's sacrilege. Get away but, from you know, me! You know. Get off of me! Oh, no one can see me here. Get away from me! In the smoke. They already know I'm here. Shut up. Alright, uh, can we get a gun play? Oh, we have a gun. Get off oh of me! God. Leave me alone! Get off of me! Lock and load. Lock and load. Get in there. Alright, let's shoot them all from here. Glenn should be just up ahead. Glenn. It's Glenn. They got him. I'm at the back of the store. Maggie! Michonne, please repeat. I think he broke up. Michonne! She looks cool. I like her outfit. <laughs> Out of ammo. Walkers, I gotta be careful. Jackpot. Axe Let's do is, this. Axe is better than a machete, in my opinion. Michonne said that they got him. Oh no, couldn't be that bastard from Woodbury. Could it? God damn it! I knew we shouldn't have left him alive. You left Merle alive? Don't Shane, mind if I do. Shane would do that, really? I need to take the edge off. Was it at Daryl's behest? Probably. Let's go with that. That's what makes sense. I'm pinned down in the guard's observation tower. Walkers everywhere. I could set off the alarm, see if it draws them away long enough for me to get out. Yeah, Here's right. the plan. Do it. Michonne! He should be just ahead. Oh, no, no. Shit. Time to bring out the big guns. Okay. Where am I supposed to 
Dear, walkers came out of the woodwork all over the prison, spent the rest of the day putting out fires and didn't get any supplies. Good one, B-Dog. Shane, you there? Come in. Read you loud and clear. He's got Glenn and Michonne. Well, shit, how the hell did he- I've got the medicine. I'm going after Glenn. Now hold your horses there, Max. You need to get your ass back here with that medicine before more people die. Shane. We'll get them back, but first things first. Get back here. Over and out. So she has a wedding ring on, so her and Glenn must be married. I thought maybe we might get to make a choice there, but no. I feel like we haven't made a choice in a while. Let me help. No. How we're looking on supplies? No. Okay, Glenn has nothing to say. They used to say you had to be ready for anything. Who could have been ready for this? Preppers. World's always been shit. Just easier to see now. It's funny. It took the world ending for my life to begin. And now that it has, I'll be damned if I let anyone or anything stand in my way. Carol, your daughter died. <laughs> I feel like she forgets that, you know? There's a Sophia-sized hole in my heart. Too far gone. Michonne and Glenn have been captured. Prepare for their rescue and to make sure those responsible pay the price. Price. With Glenn and Michonne captured, a showdown with the former Woodbury leader is inevitable. Since losing his town, he has formed a new community of followers to execute his retaliation. And to make matters worse, he also controls a military tank. Now the survivors must stop him from taking away everything they've worked so hard to build. So Merle is our big, our big opponent. What would have... What would have happened if we cuffed T-Dog instead of Merle and Merle was on our side... And then if we spared the governor's daughter, what would have happened? Shane! Come on down and have a chat with your old pal Merle! I ain't negotiating with the man pointing a loaded gun at me. Not like Morgan. Oh, you sure about that? <laughs> I need you to know I'm serious. Nothing says serious like a tank. <laughs> Besides, I wouldn't want to blast a hole in our nice new home. Here's how it's gonna go. You and your people got till sundown to get the hell out of here. Or I start pushing buttons. 
I'll tell you what, you turn your sorry ass around and go back to that rooftop in Atlanta where we left you, and I'll pretend this never happened. And hey, what part of I have a tank ain't sinking in? I'm letting you walk away from here, man. I'm showing man. you mercy that you ain't even begged for. Yet. <laughs> now we can all start shooting at each other and make a mess, but you know how that ends. We'd win, and you'd be dead. Every last one of you. Besides Daryl, that is. So what's it gonna be, Piggy? You tried to kill Daryl, like... You had a you change of heart. scared of you, man? You're just some punk-ass, one-handed redneck. <laughs> you say tank. you got a tank? I'll burn this goddamn place to the ground myself before I let you set one foot on it. <laughs> oh. It doesn't have to be this way. Are you gonna let the Chinese kids speak <laughs> to you, Shane? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Have Glenn make the case for everyone living together. Glenn can appeal to his sense of community. Have Michonne make the case for everyone living together. Michonne can convince him to stop the cycle. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Let's think about this, okay? We're dealing with Mel. And the cycle of violence. I, I think community would appeal more to Mel, you know, because strength in numbers. Mel likes violence. But coming from Glenn, Mel is a racist, like a raging racist. I mean, he... Yeah, <laughs> either way, <laughs> it's the same, really. I'm getting for community. Mm -hmm. Fuck, I don't know. I feel like Glenn, he doesn't respect Glenn. You know, he's going to be all like, oh, me, 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 you know, and he's just going to... But Michonne, maybe, maybe the cycle of violence can be like, look, you're gonna die, we're gonna die, what's the point? Oh, I'm gonna, oh, yeah, all right, Michonne. I'm not about to convince some redneck to do the right thing. <laughs> The only person who's going to convince you of anything is you. So think about it. We've been here before. How many people have died since then? Your people. Our people. Where does it end? This is a moment where everything can change. Or it can all just stay the same. Oh, Michelle. Well, guess I'll see y'all in hell then. Oh, God. <laughs> that was a dumb speech, Michonne. I thought she was getting somewhere, but like, you don't appeal to his sense of morality. He doesn't have any. You appeal to his sense of, co like, logic, you know? Like,. I think he would- I don't think anything would have worked. Alright. Uh... No! The tank, okay. 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 Right now, Where's the tank? It's time oh, there it is. Alright. Shit. <laughs> oh, I'm Carol! Fuck! Oh, okay. Oh my god. I need a better oh. angle of attack. Alright, um. Can't let them hit me. Get a sled. Lock and load. Get a sledgehammer. Get a sledgehammer. I'm gonna do damage with this. Uh, 
not get the health. Come on. Don't mind. This helps. Just a few more. Rolling away. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Take these guys out. Oh, painkillers, painkillers. Need healing. I need to take the edge off. <laughs> Time for these kids to go. <sighs> need to get rid of them. No, we need to get rid of the tank. Okay, I got the tank. I got the tank. <laughs> Choo! No, it's not. Fox! Need to destroy that tank! I already did! Oh, uh, where's the tank? Eliminate all enemies. Uh-huh. Better to stay Oh god, long. fucking Daryl with your stupid crossbow. Alright. <laughs> what the fuck? Remember, this thing's got a weak spot. Protect it. Protect it. Protect um, the tank. You need to blow it up from inside somehow. Alright, I need I need a gun. I need a gun, please. Don't let anyone near the tank. Can I jump over there? No. Why can't I go in there? Really? How am I supposed to go? Oh, I'm a sledgehammer right there. Come on. I don't have a gun? No. But no gun. Well, ammo for my crossbow. Is there a gun in one of these barrels? Find these keepers. All right, let's try to use this stupid crossbow. <laughs> Need healing. Reload. Fuck! I'm gonna die. My blood's boiling. Catch my breath. Yeah, alright. Shit. Gotta blow that tank up. Come on, Lord. come on. Oh my god, Daryl! Gotta blow that tank up. Is that it? Toss the grenade. What do you mean the grenade? Where is a grenade? There. Now. Toss grenade. Okay. I don't have one, but okay. Me, a bat? Really? Think you can beat old Merle? Yes, no. I do. 
Hey, not so tough without your tank, are you? We get a fuck. Oh, sledgehammer. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, stop. Get off of me! Oh, what? Did I pick up the sledgehammer? I picked up the sledgehammer. Thank you. Serious damage. This. Yes. Yes, Mel. <laughs> get in the fire. <laughs> oh, fuck off. What the fuck? All right, heavy, heavy attack. Come on. Come on. Only way. Oh my god. My blood's boiling. All right, get the. Got it. I've already got it. End of the line for you, pig. Let me do everything I fought for. You think I'm gonna give it to you? I'm exhausted. Hey, how's it feel knowing you're gonna lose? I'll take that. This helps. Get out of the fire. Uh, are we gonna get around two and then around three? No? Good. Here we go. I had to reset it because it glitched. I do. Lock and load. Lock and load. Lock and load. Finders keepers. War ammo is always well. Lock and load. Alright. Lock and load. This, this Help. should be enough. Okay. When was the fucking? I have to help you. Oh, for now. I hope I don't have a time I'll take limit. That. Thanks. Need help over here. Oh, let me go. Lock the hello, please. What's over there? Four hours old. Lock it low. I'll take that. Thanks. What? Oh, go. Oh, oh crap! Where am I supposed to? Get off 
me. Adrenaline, pump it. What? Go! Find your keepers. Adrenaline, pump it. <laughs> It helps. More ammo is always luck. to help them. Don't hit our people. Provide fire support. Okay. Um, sniper rifle. Pick them off one by one. I can't see through the fire. Careful now. Shot. Oh Don't hit our people. It doesn't matter. There's no friendly fire. Careful okay. now. Um. A clean shot. There's Daryl. There's Shane. Hell. Don't hit our people. Careful now. We're a clean shot. God, sniper takes so long. Come on. Don't hit our people. Shut up, Glenn. Get it up, people! <laughs> Fucking hell. Lock and low. Daryl Shine. <laughs> I can't see anything. What are you hitting, hitting Shane? I can't see anything. I can't see anything. Lock and load. He's literally okay. The blood is boiling. I have to keep going. Okay. Uh, 
let me go. I'll take that. Thanks. Get out of here. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. I see what it's doing, being all dramatic. Let's go. So did we all survive, or...? Don't look back. Just keep walking. Sanctuary for all community, for all those who su arrive, survive. Okay, that's it, I guess. A very strange place to end it. Um, yeah, I'm sorry if I seemed a little bit, I don't know, not really... I don't know, I, I'm just, just a little bit annoyed today. Um, I think my patience finally wore out. Um, I was extremely entertained in the beginning uh, during the first and second video. I, I found it absolutely hilarious, but I don't know, I think today my patience just finally wore out. Um, the gameplay is incredibly boring. Um, I cut out a lot. Um, I tried to keep it, you know, as as tight as I could um, without cutting out too much gameplay. Um, yeah, very, very dull, very samey. The story was fine, I guess. Um, like I said earlier, um, being having Shane as the leader over Rick, we're pretty... We're, we're kind of in a better position than we were with Rick in the show. More people survived. And other than that, we're pretty much the same as the TV show. So, I don't know. Nothing interesting there, really. Um, I guess they didn't really turn Shane into a straight-up villain, which I did appreciate. Um, I think it was fine. I think they... They stay true to his general demeanor and personality. Like I said in the first video, the, the voice acting was, was good. I'm, I'm actually very impressed with the voice acting. I think it was good. I think it's good. Um, sometimes when they're shouting and yelling and carrying on, it's a little bit 
funny. But other than that, I think they did a really good job, the voice actors, it em emulating their, their character's voice. So yeah, that was a good part. Um, other than that, what was the point of this game? Actually, I know what the point of this game was. It's to promote AMC's Walking Dead, the Walking Dead universe. Um, what, we have like 20 series coming out? It's just so ridiculous. Um, yeah. Um, I hope you enjoyed the series. I'm I'm sorry if uh, my my mood wasn't quite. I, I was I was not feeling it today. I was quite testy. <laughs> um, yeah. Hopefully you enjoyed the series and you could laugh at how I don't know ridiculous and just stupid. This is a really really dumb game. Um, yeah. Um, I will say editing it though is hilarious. I had so much fun editing this series just just my blood's boiling like it just cracks me up just so funny um yeah other than that i don't i don't know like just pointless from, from our perspective you know from a player perspective just pointless really let me know what you think if you have played this game i want to hear from you did you did you in enjoy it no surely not no one enjoys this game <laughs> thank you so much for watching i hope to see you for the next series or previous series on the channel i'll see you next time